Here's pro football focus on the playoff implications. So currently they have it as uh, current playoff odds, Ravens 73, Browns 28. If Baltimore wins, Browns go down to a 9% chance to make the playoffs. Um, if they win, they go up to a 42% chance, and you see even more critical as far as that AFC North goes. Currently, the Browns a 16% chance to win. If they lose, it's less than one. If they win, it's up to 26%. Baltimore down to 32%. Uh, bottom line is Browns are favored by two and a half. And Scott, you, you don't like to throw around must win. This is as close to a must win as there is for the Browns coming up Sunday. Yeah, I think I think we're there. I, I really do. Um, it's interesting. I wouldn't have thought that um, if they lost, it, it, the odds would be as high as 9%. I thought they'd be even lower than that. Um, I guess that shows you that there's teams in the AFC that also have, you know, six losses that they're competing with for a wild card spot. But it's it's a huge game, and, you know, they have also played the Steelers. They play the Bengals. So the Browns control a lot of what they need. Now, it's tough to get be too optimistic given how – they've played their last three games, but if they could get on a run and beat Baltimore, beat the Raiders, beat Pittsburgh and beat Cincinnati, no matter what happens at Green Bay, you know, if the Browns go four and one with that loss being at Green Bay, I think they wind up winning the division. I, because the schedules for the other North teams are also difficult. The Browns would have beaten all three of them. They would have the best record inside the AFC North. So, you know, I, I understand why the team is still optimistic and still, feeling like they can get accomplished what they want to accomplish because it is there in front of them. Yeah, it, wholeheartedly. I, and and I think you, I kind of feel the way you stated it. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if they win those games. I also wouldn't be surprised if they lose all three. You just you can't get a sense for how this team is going to be um, on any given Sunday. No, and we've talked about the inconsistency, and I think that's been a theme – all year long and all you have to do is look at the winning and losing streaks throughout the season right they won games in weeks two three and four that's the only time they've won had any kind of streak and they've had one two game losing streak otherwise it's win one lose one win one lose one so you know that makes you think okay they come out and beat baltimore but then they have to find a way to string some wins and we saw them do it a year ago um so it's not impossible but it just we just haven't seen it from this current group which makes you wonder if they're going to be able to figure it out, you know, with five weeks left.